Although it's possible to get cattle to go where you want them to by harassing them from behind, the fact of the matter is that when being chased, cattle really want to turn and face the enemy. If you take a little time to understand a cow's flight zone and invade it from different sides and directions, you can often get the animals to do exactly what you want them to do with less stress and minimal chance of getting injured yourself. The flight zone is an area approximated by a circle with the animal as the center point. A small wedge-shaped piece of that circle directly behind the animal is a blind spot. Spend some time in the blind spot and the cow will instinctively turn to face you. The flight zone size is directly related to how tame the animal is and how stirred up it is. Completely tame animals have almost no flight zone, while wild cattle may have a flight zone that's much more than 100 feet in diameter. If your cattle are calm, you can get them to move forward by arcing into the flight zone slightly in front of a herd leader and taking a few steps parallel and toward the rear of the animal. Once you are past the cow's halfway point, you can arc out of the flight zone, walk ahead, and then repeat the cycle. It's counterintuitive, but it works. Take a little time to study how cattle respond to the invasion of their flight zone, and you may find cowboying to be a totally calming experience. Your cattle will thank you, and your health insurance company will too.